The new eWeLink keyboard shortcuts are a seamless way to conveniently change your smart light scenes without reaching for your mobile device. Using the keyboard, you can instantly change the ambience in your home to promote better work-life balance if you work remotely, or simply change the mood with a few key presses. For anyone who watched my previous videos, you'll know I'm a big fan of smart lighting. I love the option to create different ambiances with colors and also schedule my house lighting by time of day and activity. I wanted to extend that into my home office setup, and I bought some RGB RAM, an RGB keyboard, and an RGB mouse for my latest PC build. What's more, I also have a Philips Hue lamp, which is one of my favorite pieces of kit. I was excited to learn that eWeLink recently launched a new way to create keyboard shortcuts to control the range of compatible smart lights. Unlike using an app to operate your smart lights, you can create macros for your keyboard on your computer to quickly toggle on, change, or switch off your lighting. This is going to be especially appealing to remote workers whose computer is also used for work. The psychological effect of being able to visually signify the transition from your workday to gaming mode will trigger those much needed endorphins after a long day. Now with the quick tap of a combination of buttons, you can leave behind the work stress and enter your happy place. To test out the new feature, eWeLink sent me a light strip and a smart bulb from their Sonoff range. The light strip is the latest version called L2. This is an IP65 rated waterproof strip that is more sturdy than the versions of their previous light strips. The features include a vast number of colors you can choose from, 21 preset lighting options, music sync capability, and other smart options, including the ability to integrate with Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa. Meanwhile, the Sonoff smart bulb is perfect for ambient mood lighting in a lamp, emitting 806 lumens of light. Both lights can be connected via Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, but you'll need to have them connected to your home network for the keyboard shortcuts to work. When building my latest PC, I already invested in some fun RGB lighting options for my keyboard, mouse, and RAM. With the arrival of the Sonoff lights, trying out the new keyboard shortcuts was a good excuse to complement my little office nook. The bulb comes with a standard screw fitting that can be used with most lamps. With that in mind, I found it easy to select a relatively inexpensive lamp in Home Depot that would match my aesthetic I was going for in my home. The light strip installation is also straightforward. You can cut the strip to any length following the instructions and snipping it at the pre-marked areas. Then you can use the pre-attached sticky adhesive strip on the back to mount the light strip in your desired location. The placement of the controller requires a little bit more forward planning as it needs to sit flush with the strip and also have a good line of sight with the included remote for manual use. Setting up to use the keyboard shortcuts requires a combination of the official eWeLink app and then the new eWeLink desktop application. The mobile app is the way you set up the scenes, and then you'll attribute the keyboard shortcuts using the desktop application. You start in the app by building your scene. First, pick your trigger, tap to perform, which creates a virtual button in the app interface. Then, attribute the lights you want to include in the scene. Save your setup, and then you'll turn your attention to the desktop application. Log into your eWeLink account using the same credentials as your mobile app, and you'll be presented with a list of empty slots for you to start building different keyboard shortcuts. First, click on the Select Manual Scenes, and then click on the Enter a Shortcut dialog. From here, simply press the combination of keys you want to trigger the scenes, and that's it. As a final step, you just want to ensure the desktop application launches on startup in the settings in the event you restart your computer. The desktop app needs to be running in the background to be able to use the shortcuts. Performance is perfect. There is no delay or lag when using your shortcuts, which is very satisfying. The response is immediate. One tip that I have for using shortcuts is to use combinations of keys that don't interfere with your most used shortcuts in other programs. For instance, I chose Shift plus Control plus P to launch my party scene, as Control P in most applications is the default for printing. Fine tuning your choices will ultimately come down to personal preference. Thanks for watching and as always, please like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content on the connected home and personal technology.